Bill and Rachel are two competitors who sell lemonade at a dollar per glass. Each person sells 200 glasses daily, and after subtracting expenses from the $200 revenue, is left with $100 as pure profit. To oversimplify, you put 50 cents in your pocket after each $1 sale. One day, Bill thinks about offering lemonade at just 80 cents, so 30 cents in profit per glass. However, one, he'd have to sell 334 glasses instead of 200 to earn $100.20 in profit, so attract 134 of Rachel's 200 customers just so he can make about the same amount as he is now. Two, Rachel won't just stand there and lose customers, she'd lower prices as well. In the end, he assumes both of them will most likely earn less than they do now. The same thoughts probably crossed Rachel's mind as well, and she came to the same conclusion. Therefore, both of them keep prices at $1, and from a game theory perspective, we call the situation a state of Nash equilibrium. Named after the famous mathematician John Nash, the Nash equilibrium is basically a situation where two or more competitors decide they're better off not changing their existing strategy. As a quick test, start watching our video about the prisoner's dilemma and try to identify its Nash equilibrium.